Uh, welcome back, dear students, to yet another interview with the topper, Dr. Varsha Motwani, who has secured 18th rank in NEET SS 2023. Many congratulations, Dr. Varsha. Let's start with this interview. Let's start with your background a little. Where did you do your UG and PG from? And then how did you decide to go ahead with NEET SS? Dr. Varsha. Thank you so much, ma'am. Thank you so much. Ma'am, uh, I basically have done my UG from GMC Raipur and PG from GMC Nagpur. And since my PG days only, I was knowing that I want to go for Gynec Wonderful. But uh, so ma'am, then you I... complete your PG? Ma'am, I have completed my PG in 2019. Then I joined GCRI Fellowship, Gynec All right. So you're already doing fellowship in oncology. Yes, ma'am. I've done two years fellowship and then I mm -hmm. got rank 49 in first attempt. All right. Then, ma'am, I missed mop-up round. I was not knowing about this mop-up round at that time. So I missed a seat in that round. And then uh, last attempt which I gave was uh, I got a rank and I got a seat at Amrita also. But then because of one document, they didn't give me admission. So two times you've got the seat and you didn't get yes, the seat actually. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. That was the point. But uh, the one thing which... Then still you were consistent me... and you were ready to give it another try. Wonderful. Yes, ma'am. Because I was knowing that I want it and I you want it by this. any... Yes, ma'am. I have to do it. So just because of that... I would. I was a bit depressed because of the those things, ma'am. How can someone not by securing rank? You have seat, but because of few difference. problems, yes, ma'am. So then I this time I decided to give it hundred percent, more than hundred percent. So I gave my total three months preparation. Oh, three months you just said sudden prepared. So when did you start exactly preparing for the SS? Which year, ma'am? I started in twenty twenty only when I was doing fellowship. I mm -hmm. thought fellowship will be my plan B, which was the wrong thinking, I think. I should have given it a full attempt on that thinking only, that without doing fellowship, I, I would have done. Okay. So tell me, uh, how was the preparation like in 2020? What were your sources? Ma'am, I used to read complete books. I was not having any coachings at that time. No, oh, nothing I did because I was not having any idea. No guidance was there. So I was completely going through Williams Obstetrics and Spiroff and that Novak's complete. I was a textbook person. Okay. So that... So then when did you join Repronet Learning? When did you get to know? Ma'am, Repronet, I joined this year only in April. Oh, all right. So April you yes. joined. And then yes. how did you find uh, the... Ma'am, Repronet is the app which everyone needs and everyone should do it because the app is very much concise. So I was knowing that from April, I have less time only because I was uh, I was having less time. Then last three months, I was having a total time. And in that time, I finished every video. I revised it. I revised your videos almost five times, ma'am. All right. Wonderful. And your notes also, I revised five times. I do not make notes, ma'am. So I just revise, keep them revising. Okay. So since April, you revised all the videos and re you revised all the notes. You did not have to make after, your own notes. After April, I started your videos. I completed that in one and a half months almost. Oh, and then I started okay. revising. Yes, ma'am. That's wonderful. So since you already had a background, you read all the big books, it was easy for yes, you to finish all the videos in one and a half months. Yes, ma'am. That's why. And then I kept on revising because I do not make notes. I don't have habit of making notes. So yes. I just kept on revising videos and notes and notes again and again. Whenever And your guidelines, ma'am, the app is so concise that I was not having guidance during that time. I was not knowing that questions come from guidelines and few things are like that. So, you guide in such a way that this app only helped me to crack this rank. Otherwise, ma'am, I was not in that secure position to have that seat. Really get rank. Yes, Wonderful. So, it it feels nice to hear that you could complete all the videos in one and a half months. So, it is a kind of a concise revision that you can do with the app. If you want to crack it in three, four months... Yes, ma'am. Yes, you can crack it with the help of this. Wonderful. So, uh, for the last three months uh, before the exam, you were not working anywhere, or you were doing your fellowship still. Ma'am, I was working. I joined somewhere as SR. Then I just uh, came to know that I cannot do like that because it was very heavy, hectic duties I was having. So I just left that job for last three months. That uh, I left it in July end, and then July mid fifteen July around, and then till September I was reading at home, like that. Ma'am, I prepared. So what difference I found from the last exam is last exam was an ops paper, yes, not very tough paper, paper, not yes, standard yes. questions. So those uh -huh. who were working, those who had just completed their PGs, they had a benefit because the questions were from ward rounds. And yes, this yes. year it was a standard paper, all guidelines and all protocols. Uh, the There were good questions. This year's paper totally was good. the paper. Oh. Yes, ma'am. Yes, it was much the different. Paper. So those who have given time, those who have actually read were the ones who have cleared this time. This difference I found. Last time the result was very unpredictable. Only those who... Um, 
those who read actually did not get good marks in the last paper yes ma'am that is the point that and ma'am you always say neat is very unpredictable neat is it very is unpredictable yes it is very and unpredictable i always pray for a difficult paper because if it's a difficult paper my students are going to fare better in a difficult paper i know that i'm uh, many a times we used to keep uh, not doing videos but then your words keep coming like you have to revise you have to do it and somewhere in your uh, these rankers videos i have heard that keep revising keep revising yes. so that all this was the mantra last year everyone would say keep revising after fet also they said that you have to keep, keep revising complete around and then keep revising Com always the point keep so revising. read only that much which you will be able to revise and ma'am uh, my point is like just sit in the last month what uh, whoever is preparing yes. just post 50 days you have to give it time you have to give it you have to make it your focus your priority for those last 2 3 months and then yes, only last bracket last few days are really very important ma'am anything changes and you keep on recollecting what to read like ma'am your uh, videos and your pdfs come to mind when the questions flash on the screen in the examination day that is very helpful ma'am keep on revising and just have that image to keep okay, so that helped me uh, wonderful it is so nice talking with you dr varsha how did you find the paper when you uh, got the paper what was the feeling that it is going to be easy or it is going to be tough and when you I'm went to the paper doing questions i was feeling that it is like i can do it okay. i am doing it and i will do a mistake yes ma'am and the one thing i was knowing ki i should not just i should not get confused now and i have to do it my 100% so that yes. was also Yes. So when you take so many exams, no, the third exam, you are composed, you are balanced that this, this the performance during exam is important. This is what happens in the first attempts. We are very nervous that we have read so much and then we are going to mess it up. So that feeling has to go. You have to be composed, balanced during your exam. Yes, ma'am. You have to work from your mind. Nothing, no, nothing helps. Just a calm yes. mind. Is... Yes, yes your mind should be, uh, you know, relaxed at that time is what I believe. Yes, ma'am. So even if the paper is difficult, my advice to students is that you have to, uh, you know, convince yourself that you're going to do it. You will yes, be able to do it. Just go on marking what comes to your head. And ma'am, one thing that increases your confidence is revision and your notes and yes. video. You have to revise and how many times you can do, you should do. It's like that. Yes. And okay. when you read from big books, it's difficult to revise. How will you revise a 3,000 page or 4,000 page book? Not possible, ma'am. So ma'am, in the... Although I have read all the standard books, but in these last, I didn't go with any of the books. I only went through your videos. I only... The so did last I... three months, there was no need to open the books, right? Yes, ma'am. No, None ma of the nothing. students did. They either made no. their own notes or they went through the videos. Only last three months, you cannot touch the textbooks. And they should so not... You waste your time. It is really helping. They should only go with something concise, which they can revise. Yes which can be revised. Read only all that you can revise. Wonderful. Yes. So how many questions did you uh, leave in the exam? How many you did not mark? I did 148. I left two. Only two questions you left. So that should yes. be the target. You have to leave two to five questions only. Yes. If you have prepared well, you will, uh, you know, that is that is the aim that you should have. Wonderful. Yes. Any advice you would want to give to the people who are preparing now for the next exams? Um, I would say consistency and revision. Yes. Because there are and downs in everyone's life everyone is yes. going through some struggles so there yes. is something that will try to stop you so just be consistent yes. consistent that is the only thing i will say yes so at least for the last three months they have yes. to leave everything all their life struggles and everything aside if they want to crack for three months this the need ss has to be prioritized, prioritized. To, how much time would you give to reading in these last three months Ma'am, I used to sit, uh, in last few days, so I used to sit completely, last few days, because I was knowing I can, this is like, I was decided, ma'am, this is my last attempt. Whatever it is, I will give everything. Okay. So because left, I have been... Uh, I have that must have been a lot of pressure during the exam. It was, ma'am, it was. Yes, because... but still, you were, uh, you know, quite confident and uh, composed in the exam, so that's... So one thing that helps while reading at home, alone, completely, is like, Having some mentor like you, like some guidance is there, like which keeps you going. So don't be alone and sit reading because something comes yes. up your mind. You need some human interactions in those times yes, also. So well. you would sit in the morning after your breakfast or before your breakfast and you would just read. Like we would do in, I think, PMT exams before our MBBS exams when we had like, I mean, it was, it was a bit bad, but I used to take breaks also so that I can uh, some breaks like to keep me motivated some half hour break or 15 minutes break like that 
But and I was the last three months you were only reading. Yes, nothing last else. Yes, nothing else. All the day you were just reading and doing nothing else. No partying, no festivals. Nothing. This that <laughs> this students uh, we doctors have this uh, you know habit of skipping all the family functions and festivals when we are for sitting for the exam preparation. We'll not go anywhere. We'll not do anything. So for three months mm -hmm. you were in your room with the app and with your. And sometimes helps also, and sometimes it doesn't help also. But this helped me a lot. Last three months were very helpful for me to sit and read. Oh, wonderful! It was so nice having you uh, for the interview, Doctor Varsha. We'll surely stay in touch. I'll be needing you more after this after you have got a seat. So uh, one more thing before we end.